Hello, welcome. My name is Emily. This is Updog Yoga. This is a yoga channel where I discuss a bunch of yoga poses, yoga classes, and tutorials. One thing I really love is the hero's journey of superheroes in pop culture and the parallels of the hero's journey in spiritual texts like the Bhagavad Gita, Yoga Sutras, things like that. Both kind of require a leap of faith. If you're going to sit there and watch a movie, <laughs> you you have to buy into it a little bit. Same thing with any kind of spiritual text. You know, these people are not in front of you. You just ha have to trust the words on the page. For today's video, I thought it would be amazing to imagine that superheroes are coming to my yoga class and what are the specific yoga poses that I would recommend to each superhero. So I have a whole collection of yoga poses and superheroes. And if I haven't gotten to your favorite superhero, let me know your favorite in the comments and we'll try to get to it in a future video. So first up is Batman. He appears to be some sort of bodybuilder. Now when I taught bodybuilders in gyms, they couldn't do back bends. So I would recommend right away to do more back bends like bridge pose, bow pose, camel pose, and to add some of these. On your hands and knees, lift your left leg and your right arm up. So extend out, spread your toes and then release, switch sides. This is to balance out and lengthen both sides of the body, lengthen the muscles along the spine. It's called bird dogs or sunbird. Tried to research if there was a pose called bat pose. The only one I could find was grab your big toes and extend your legs out. In kids yoga, this is called bat pose. And for relaxation, I recommend to put your legs on a chair. So you sit close to the edge of the chair, swing your feet on the chair, Lie down and let your palms face up. Next up is Superman. We have a pose that is already named after him. For warrior three, plant your foot down, reach forward, float your leg, and also reach your arms out. Movie, he's always throwing, throwing things. So I would recommend Revolve Triangle, which is you start in Warrior One, straighten your front leg, and go into a twist. This will help stretch all those muscles that are involved in throwing. So also great for baseball players, that sort of movement. Other side. Wonder Woman. Naturally, we do a goddess pose and a warrior pose, and she is a warrior. And I would recommend eagle pose. Cross your leg, cross your arms, and sit down into a chair. Another one is tree pose, just for focus, balance. And peacefulness. For advanced version, try your foot in half lotus. Next hero I love, the Flash. He has a symbol of the lightning bolt. This is actually called lightning bolt pose when you sit on your feet, toes. This is called thunderbolt. It's an awesome toe stretch. Since he is a runner, these are poses that I re would recommend for any runner. Shift forward into a low lunge. Bring your hand to your thigh, come into a side stretch. Bring your hands down, lift your toes. And this is a runner stretch. Take opposite hand to your foot and twist your chest. Or even a runner stretch. Walk your foot to the edge of your mat, hands to the inside and lower to your forearms. Next is Aquaman. These are the poses that I would recommend for any swimmer. Half pigeon, bring one leg forward, stretch the other leg back and lean into the stretch. Upward facing dog, you shift forward, let your belly drop, pull your heart forward. 
And if the flexibility is available, bend your knee, reach back, kick your foot into your hand. In Pilates, these are called swimmers. Lift opposite arm and leg. Next up, Catwoman. So we have cat pose where you press your palms down and round your spine like a Halloween cat. Cat pulling its tail. Step your foot forward, shift forward, and reach back. Lean into the stretch like a cat pu pulling its tail. She's a little more acrobatic, so I would recommend any kind of gymnastic style handstands. Four big back bends. For strength, plank taps, tap opposite shoulder. Last, Harley Quinn, since we know so much about her, here are a few poses I think she would love. Lie on your back, bend your knee, hug your knee into your chest, and then extend up into a hamstring stretch. Circle your toes. Wild thing, lift your leg, bend your knee, move into a back bend. And finally, headstands. So thank you so much for joining me. I hope you had a great time. I post videos twice a week. I also have a bunch of cosplay from Halloween. Check out my shorts. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.